thing you seek. It is trapped in hell forever. Okay, thank you for your input, Dr. Petruger. And on that note, hey everybody, welcome back to Doom 3 2553. I'm your host, Willie B. Coyote, and in the last video, I struggled with teleportation technology. Here's an instant replay. Before we continue, let's get the self-promotion done right out of the gate. Be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. It helps me grow and hopefully get paid as well. Also, make sure to hit the notification icon on your way out so you never miss an upload. And without further ado, let's get into it. So, um, full disclosure, um, this is actually my third attempt to record this. First time I was having skill issues left and right and I kept dying like a noob because I'm an idiot like that. And, uh, second time I screwed up my audio and my voice was barely audible pretty much. Thank you for your chainsaw, friend. But anyways, hopefully this is the third time lucky, you know? Please don't attack me with a chainsaw. That's much appreciated. Okay. Locker 104, code 579. Over here. 79. Voila. And through here. Now, what's happening in here? What are you doing, Petruger? What are you doing? Oh, that's not good. What are you up to? Oh no, there's a scientist. Look out, dude! There's a Hell Knight behind you! Look out! Oh no! Ah, so much for that guy. Okay. That tears it. This means war! Of course you realize this means war. It's BFG time. Take that. And that. And that. And some of this. And some of that. Oh, frick. Reload. And some of this. Whoa, what are you doing, Petruger? What the hell are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Fuck me, what happened? The shape of things to come. The time has come for the forces of hell to escape their prison and drive mankind into darkness. Oh man. Your darkest fears will soon be realized as your soul burns in hell. There's no hell to run. I am everywhere, and you will never find the thing you seek. Uh, right. Thank you for the inspirational evil supervillain monologue, Dr. Petruger. Oh. Well, I feel sorry for that guy. Anyways, uh... As you can clearly see now, everybody, we are in hell. Welcome to hell, motherfucker! <laughs> By the way, if you haven't watched Tales from the Hood Part 1, I highly recommend it. It's one of the best horror anthology movies ever made. Uh, Tales from the Hood 2, even though it does have Keith David, was nowhere near as good as Tales from the Hood 1. Let's... here. Okay, then. Who wants to go into the big, scary beam of light first? Oh, what the hell. YELLOW! What did he say? Whoa, whoa, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Oh, whoa! Are you really putting me inside of a cage right now? Seriously? That's really, really cliche if you think about it. <laughs> Man, you are one pathetic loser. <laughs> okay. Oh, imps. We got contact, contact, lots of contact. Lots and lots of hostile contact. Reloading. Right, so, uh, another little bit of housekeeping to go over, um, the content oh. warning video did the best out of any video I've put out so far. Ignored the creepy evil laughter in the background. Um, 
And, uh, yeah, but the Quake 4, like, most recent Quake 4 video didn't perform as well, so... And there's a Hell Knight. So, uh, yeah, if you guys could, like, you know, like and subscribe and, you know, go watch that video, I would highly appreciate it. That would be awesome if you could do that. Oh boy, it's the bug baby things. I hate these things. They are really creepy and they are really annoying. Die. Die, please. Thank you. Armor. Health kit and I got the chainsaw back, thankfully. More health. up oh by the way always take time to quick save that's a uh, important uh, detail to know there come back here grab the assault rifle here Like, can you just imagine, like, in the lore of the mod here, you know, you're a UNSC Marine, you survived the Human Covenant War, barely, and, like, not even less than a year afterwards, you get sent to hell because of some crazy scientist on an abandoned, on a creepy research complex on Mars. Like, come on. Like, that would just be like, ugh. This is bullshit. Here, I'm gonna quick save again because this is where I had uh, skill issues last time. Okay. Okay, gotta be mindful of this. And here come lost souls, which are also really annoying. I really, really love that uh, Valkyrie, the guy who made this mod, uh, made the pistol actually a viable weapon. Because in vanilla Doom 3, the p the pistol kind of sucks, but you know, it's a lot better in the in the mod because he like tweaked the way it performs, you know. So you can basically mag dump it. Oh no! Come on! Ow! <sighs> I have a feeling this is going to become a recurring theme in this episode. You know, what? screw it. I'm just going to run across as fast as I can and try not to die. Run, 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 come on. Don't stop for anyone or anything. And kill these guys. Reload. Reload. Is there an auto reload setting that's not turned on or whatever when I run out of ammo to auto reloads? Here, hang on a second, I'll be right back. Three days later. Okay, I'm back, and no, there's no auto-reload setting in this game. Oh well. Could be worse. Frickin' lost souls, I hate these things. I'm gonna save it again real quick. Be right back. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. This is probably gonna be a recurring theme in this episode, but you know what? What the hell? <laughs> I say as I'm literally in hell. Up, oh, hell knight. Die, die please. Come on. This is not cool. There you go. Thank you very much for that imp. Loading. Another imp. Heal up. Grab med kits. There's an odd amount of UNSC equipment in this uh, alternate demonic dimension here. Um, through here. And there's a Mancubus. Oh no, 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 you're not gonna screw me on this one. Come on. Mancubus is dead. Reload. Uh, there we go. 
Here, I'm gonna save again after that. There we go. And I got the plasma. Whoa. Death will not be your end. Your soul will burn in hell forever. Ah, uh, yeah. You want to bet on that, Patruger? And the business. We call this foreshadowing. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Berserk power up. It's rip and tear time. Boosh! Boosh! This was for Jeff. This one's for Frank. This one's for Jimmy. This one's for Gertrude, I guess. <laughs> that one's for Alice. That one's for Maxie. And Berserk Power Up is over. Let's uh, clear my area real quick. Load. And there's the Hell Knight. Whoa. Okay, so now I just gotta find my way out of here. How hard can it be? Oh, how I've missed the pang of dread, I feel, whenever you mention the words, how hard can it be? <laughs> so, um, another bit of housekeeping I need to go over, uh, my upload schedule might get a little more sporadic in the near future because, uh, ah, rocket launch bag, that's handy. Here, let's check this PDA we just picked up. Um, let's see, uh, Expedition Expectation. Simon, as you know, you've been assigned to Expedition 14A-2. There are several goals we hope your team will be able to meet while on the expedition. Since you are familiar with the discovered tablets, we sh would like you to find cooperative evidence on the other side of this main portal. Similar writings of any kind should be photographed and collected. Primarily, we are looking to capture several more biospecimens. Having already collected many of the smaller imp creatures, we would like to bring back one of the larger ones described by others as a Hell Knight. Previous expeditions have reported seeing them at, main, at the main portal destination, where you will be arriving. You will have several weapons with you, but we ask that you attempt to use non-lethal force. We would really like to have a live specimen if possible. Finally, traveling through the portal has caused varied reactions. For our records, we would like you to keep an audio log of everything you experience for us to later analyze. Do... Do anything useful here. Looking at the sky, I and other team members noted what appeared to be a Covenant ship of some kind floating in the void. I beg your pardon? What? What the fuck? It was directly beneath the landmass we had perched on. From what I could tell, the ship is heavily damaged and all that remains of the center is the center portion of the ship. The front and engines being entirely gone. Found saying Healy bone fragments in one of the cages. I have several questions. There's more of that, uh... Uh, lore dumping that Valkyrie, the absolute Giga Chad who made this mod, uh, stuck in there to kind of like make it work in the Halo universe. Through here, save again because uh, I don't want to have to start all over again after I went through that fracas. Oh, rocket launcher time. Yeah, two rockets will take down a Mancubus, so that's good handy to know. Jump. And they'll also insta-kill Lost Souls. The frick. Boosh, boosh. Boosh, Boosh. Speaking of Boosh, I've been watching The Mighty Boosh on Hulu a lot lately. That show is so funny. Let's 
take down this guy. Seriously, though, that show is really, really funny, and I highly recommend it. Uh, Noel Fielding is just absolutely fantastic in that show. Reload. Whoa, what the... So, yeah, um, I've got some big stuff that's going to be happening in the near future, so my upload schedule is probably going to be a lot more sporadic um, for the next couple of months. But, uh, yeah, hopefully by the time summer rolls around, I'll be at back to the uh, standard weekly uploads. And uh, I might be able to increase my schedule because um, uh, I'm in between jobs at the moment, so I'm not able to afford to hire an editor. But, you know, if I can get an editor, I can, uh, that'll be, a uh, free me up to be able to record a lot more so I can start getting more videos up on the channel, which is something I want to be able to do. Um, yeah. No, no, I'm not getting cornered by, uh, by Hell Knight here. Boom. Take that. Uh, oh! Oh no! 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 Load. Reload. Here, I'm gonna save again real quick. No, no, I don't want to use uh, the rockets here for this section. It's not a smart move there to make there. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock! Okay, I'm gonna save again. Great, I got three Hell Knights to deal with. That's one down. Missed. I'm out of rockets. Which is not good. Load. Here, I'm just out running this guy here. He's down. Reload. There's number three. Just keep hammering him with the plasma rounds. Reload. Ha, there we go. Nice try, bug baby. Or whatever it's called in Doom 3. Comment down below. What's the official canonical name of that enemy archetype in this game? Of the, like, baby grub things. And Mancubus! Mancubus! Heal up. Reload, reload, come on. Got more health and ammo. And he's down. Heal up again. There we go. And another one. That's fantastic. Loading. Another one. What? No, 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 no. Those things are annoying. Thank you for med kits.
looks like I managed to take that Mancubus down. That's uh, nice. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! And because I didn't save, I'm right back here again. So, which I will fix with the power of editing. So, as I snap my fingers, two thousand years later, and we're back. That was quite a fracas, but uh, we're back on track now. Take that guy down. I freaking I freaking hate these things. Die, die, die! Oh, come on. I have a feeling that that's going to be a recurring theme on this episode. And door opens. Mancubus is there. Take him down. Heal up. Reload. And through here, I take down the grub baby thing. Take down the other grub baby thing. Take down third grub baby thing. And set about killing my third or fourth mancubus today. Die. Thank you. Health and ammo, that's always appreciated. Gonna save. Whole oh, lot of saving going on. <laughs> that could honestly be like a, a sales campaign for somebody, you know? Like if like freaking Wayfair's having like a clearance sale or something. Because hey, you can't beat the free two day shipping, you know? Um, take that guy down, and yay, I took him down! I took him down! Yay, me! Up through here. Save again, because I don't want to go through that pain train again. Through here. For every step you take, For every your soul you take. moves closer to me. Yep, and that means I'm one step closer to killing you, Petruger. So let's go. Suffering and pain Suffering waits for you. Right. So I grab. There's a whole huge cache of ammo here, which is definitely not indicative that a boss battle is probably going to happen around the corner. Totally, definitely not. I even got a whole bunch of rockets. And I'm going to lock and load all my weapons and for the inevitable fact that I'm definitely not going to go through here, and I'm definitely not going to face a boss battle, and everything's going to be sunshine, happiness, and rainbows. It's false. No way. Not this time. We created it. Not this time. No. Not this time. It's totally made up. Pure fiction. All right. And the words of the old man, Leroy Jenkins! The heck is that? Oh boy, that doesn't sound good. Oh no. Oh man, that is one big giant pile of ugly. Oh, I hope you're ready, dude. I hope you're ready. Okay, so for this boss battle, you gotta shoot the glowing thing on its back. But in order to expose the glowing thing on its back, you have to take down those floating things that it spawns from its back as well. So, uh, yeah, mostly just run around. There's ammo, ammo pickups around. Just try not to get cornered, try not to run out of ammo, and, uh, try not to die. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Okay. And try not to waste too many of your... Thank you, I did just say that, uh, disembodied voice, but, uh... Um... 
Yes. Okay. Reload, reload. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Boosh, 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 boosh. Come on, come on, come on. I'm low on med kits. And, uh. I don't want to die again. I, I want to try and get this. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. That's what I'm trying to do. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you for the advice, disembodied voice. That's what I'm trying to do. Come on. Reload, come on. Reload, 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 reload. Come on, come on, come on. Seek you down. Come on. Reload. Ah, 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 great, now I gotta start this over again. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Okay. Got all my ammo, let's try this again. Skip that cutscene. Because... We have a good eye on the cringe over. <laughs> Officer based, bro? Based? Based on what? <laughs> They're here. Come on, I gotta reload. Come on. Eat ammo. Yeah, I think I'll use my assault rifle for the Seekers from here on, not waste precious rockets on them. Okay. Reload. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's what I'm trying to do. Come on, come on. Come on. Well, I got at least one direct hit, so that's nice. Come on, come on, come on. Load, come on. Up. It's two down. One, two. Oh, yeah, I got him! He is down for the count. Oh, I love using Sweet Victory. <sighs> I'm still so mad that they didn't do that during the Super Bowl. Well, they did do it this year, so uh, that's cool. And what is this thing? Okay. Free us from our eternal prison, and we will help you. Vanquish our enemies, and we grow stronger. Okay. Listen for our call, and then free us to smite down the evil. Okay, then. Right, so I got this, uh, demonic artifact here. Is there a- Ah, oh, here we are! Let's go through here. And we're right back at the beginning of the level again. Okay. Well, I think that's as good a spot as any to end the video for today. Um, I managed to survive going to hell, and presumably in the next episode, I'm gonna head back up to the surface, uh, 
head back to the Mars City facility and uh, go curb stomp Dr. Petruger once and for all. Well, how hard can it be? Don't say that! Uh, thanks to everybody for tuning in. Be sure to tune in next time. I've been Willie B. Coyote, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!